I'm Karabu Lukele, freshman student. I'll be doing the, the others out of the tracks, talking about motherly love and the different kinds of loves you can get from your biological mother and a, an actual lady that is not my mom. Growing up, I lived two separate lives. One with my stepmother, who I say is my aunt, and the other one with my, with my biological mother. My biological mother had no love for me. She treated me like trash. My biological mother abused and tortured me every day of my life. On the other side, my aunt, who played the role of my mother, gave me love, respect, and warmth a childhood would ever want. My journey of motherly love started when my mother wanted nothing to do with me at the age of six months old after birth, when she left me at my grandmother's doorsteps with no explanation. My grandmother and aunt took good care of me and treated me like one of their own. I was a happy child that received love and good education with a bright future till my dad's death in 1996. My mother took me back as soon as my dad passed out with her own reasons and changed my life to the worst. Having her own reasons for taking me back, she made me suffer and showed me no signs of love and no intentions of motherly love. My aunt, on the other hand, played a major role as my mother in my growth. She did everything a kid would ever wish for. She gave me love, showed me equality with her, with her own kids and never treated me any different to her own kids. On the other side, my biological mother treated me like dirt. She, she, she dehumanized me and treated me like no other human being should be treated. She abused me, never cared about my feelings and my academics, made me do chores a kid at eight would never do. When I compare my mom and my aunt's love, my aunt's love was a million times better with no conditions behind it. My mother took me back knowing that my, mother, my father had left me money in his estate. My aunt knew the potential I had. My, my aunt knew my weaknesses, my strengths, and my, and my desire and passion of what I want to do in life, which is I want to be a professional soccer player. I want, to, I want to have a bright future and my aunt made sure I get all those things. My mother never wanted anything to do with me so she never knew anything and never knew my route of success and my plans of life. My aunt encouraged me to build on my future by going to school and achieve my dreams of becoming a professional soccer player. Right now I'm close to becoming, a, I'm becoming one and I'm pushing